Daddy's family can't just turn my back on him for no reason. Well, I really liked the character. Uh, I liked the story, but I, more than anything, I just loved this guy. When I was reading the script, I thought this is such a cool uh, person and a, and a fun. It would be a fun character to play, and it would be fun to be able to be this guy for a couple of months that is not cynical in any way and not judgmental, and you know, looks different than parts that I normally get to play. You know, I, I looks different than parts I've played in the past. I like to think that if you put your trust out there, I mean, if you really give people the benefit of the doubt, see their best intentions, I mean, can you hold us? People will rise to the occasion. It was the idea of playing somebody who cho chooses to live their life seeing the best in people. I thought that that's, that's not a bad world to exist in for a while. Don't take this the wrong way, because Dylan is totally the asshole in this situation, yeah, for he's sure. A, he's a douchebag. Yeah, I hate his guts, but... Is it possible that, you know, maybe you thought you gave up? No, it's true. I was trying to think when we were there, it was so rare to be amongst other women of my contemporaries. Um, you know, it was so cool, you know, because normally there's just one of you, you know. Um, uh, so I, I, I was very aware that we were really lucky to have all these parts written for us by Jesse, um, Jesse and his sister. <laughs> Jesse is um, a woman's guy. He loves women and he really respects them. And and you feel that being around him. He just is a he 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 sort of has the feeling that which my dad had actually that women should be running the world. You know. You know, I try and do good, but I just screw it up. On top of it all, I broke down and smoked with a kid that lives across the street from me. Okay, I didn't just hear that. I said,